Yes, Outriders content is not dead on my channel. I've played the cat game for two days and I'm kind of exhausted and tired. I haven't even finished it, but now modding is a thing, so... There's gonna be a lot of cat content coming too, stray content, but... I'm always keeping my baby Outriders alive. And today we're gonna test this gun. The Rarox Geis. I feel like Geis means brick in German. Like a stair, something like that. Staring into the, the abyss. But yeah, I've thrown Ultimate Storm Whip onto it. So, which is the Thunderbird ability, Donna Fogel ability. Because I didn't seem to find anything better. And I could have, if I deleted MR Chaos, could also throw the MR Chaos Noxious Spawns ability onto it. Ah, uh, it's a decent gun, but you have to wonder if you want to get an ability onto it where you can get more ammo back. That's even the question. Hey, I like that building. Aqueduct almost like. So I was. Asking myself, do I? Tiago want... was right about that hum. My teeth are chattering from the vibration. Strange structure. Some kind of switch over there. You feel it, hum? Is that just me? Tell me, which Mass Effect character said that? So, I'm just gonna play this with Thunder Strike. Thunder Strike. That just kind of was, <laughs> was good. I just messed up. So this might be a good deadly combination. That should kill quickly. And I feel like the AoE damage is also not that bad. Look at that. Three people got thunder strike right there. And again. And again, now two people this time. So yeah, that's what I just thrown, thrown onto the gun. Come on, let me charge him. Thunder strike for days. So you can already see it doing some damage. It's like a repeater, a repeater gun. I hope I pronounced it right. Repeater, rep, repeater. No, <laughs> it's definitely not repeater. That one is for sure. Also, critical headshot damage supposed to do something. Oh, okay. Dodge was still perfect. And the butt shots too. Is it a buck shot or a butt shot weapon? And be both. So one more wave. One shot into the magazine. Yeah, right now, our last two days have been stray farming content, which, yeah, I, I guess my future in this game will be modding a lot. Modding the game up, testing all the mods, that will be my stray future. I still hope for a good new Outriders update to open up the endgame expeditions for epoch loot but i feel like i'm gonna try today right after this session the trials with actually random people online maybe that speeds just things up that would be therefore better if just everything gets speed up sped up a little Up, up, up. 
But that is a nice little decent gun to have. Oh, that's not the right button. Weird. The gate opened. So a lot of one shot abilities on there. And killing spree also. Gives you more damage. Yeah. I had lots of times where I struggled to finish this nice map. Thanks for interrupting me for just saying nice view. I just gonna take a random loading screen thumbnail I've prepared. And I'm gonna An obelisk just... mechanism in the middle. Could be the way forward. You like interrupting me, don't you, Mr. Outrider? If you call vocal fry voice. Nice obelisk mechanism in the middle. Could be the way out. It's kind of surprising to me that out of all the games I've let's played so far, Dolman got me the most views. Alex had a, uh, Alex 2. Alex 2 had a good time for a short week or two. Well, I did the up quests before everyone else. I feel like I finished Alex before a lot of YouTubers could, anyways. Like, I was pretty cool with Alex, but it was a German one after all. With me still not being that experimented on YouTube. On not what I'm doing. Outriders World Slayer was a little bit mixed. And yeah, views too matter in the end, but I'm definitely someone who starts a playthrough and finishes it and also stands to what he says he's going to do. Not like a like a lot of other YouTubers who start a franchise, see it won't get them any views in the long term and just stop that, even though that's Maybe a better business strategy. What of a lot of dudes do nowadays, especially if they have editors on their side. That's whoop, let me get out of here real quick. Play through one game of Steam or so on Steam on Twitch, live stream it, and Then the editors make a highlight video of that. Which is a cool concept, but it's an impossible concept to do that alone. Because editing takes a long time. And if I recorded like eight or seven videos of Stray, I don't have the time next to uploading and doing thumbnails. I don't have the time to get best highlights out of that immediately. Also my video editing software, the free one I used, Filmforth just turned on me. Which I made a video of. Oh, need ammo. So basically I can't do high level editing videos unless I invest the money which is not that much money to invest but still it was free beforehand and now they just put a price tag on the same stuff they had for free which I hate and I don't want to support whoa 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 those predatory greedy business strategies Sure, also a good business strategy. Get people used to that. Editing software, give it to them for free. Then where they need it the most. Turn on them. I have a big Star Wars video coming up and bland, which I wanted to go crazy on editing wise. Which kinda 
it's not that possible right now so I have to probably do it with the Windows Movie Maker, the old one. Still might get me good quality but still with most free to use movie or video editing softwares you can't you can't have the video coming out of it in 2k it's mostly capped but 1020p So what I did with my Mass Effect franchise, I made cool intros and then edited the video or oh, finished it. Oh, what's the word? After I was done editing, it still came out in 2K resolutions, which, yeah, every other video editing software free one I used didn't give me those capabilities and I looked into buying ones there are apparently just two or three good ones there's also DaVinci Resolve which is also free but it's kinda it didn't work for me and the other ones what, what are they called Novave or Las Vegas I think something like that studios They are pretty expensive. I need to hurry. Some of them over 600 euros, and that's not quite that important then, because or worth it, because I then I also need to put time into learning them new video editing techniques. And after doing so much that already, well. is it triggering the storm? I can't just put too much time into video editing too. I'm quite overwhelmed anyways. This will be a tough, a tough fight. I need to get my kills already. Going on and I will focus a lot and not talk that much. And probably will just throw pop shots at them. Um, three seconds or four seconds is the cooldown on Thunder Strike. I need to be aware of that and abuse that as much as possible. Also run circles like a maniac. Oh, I'm a madman. Oh boy. That's not the spot I want to be in. Okay, thanks for letting me teleport out of there. I got one of the big boys isolated, which is very important. Huh? With wrong one. Up, oh, and there the mosquitoes come. Let me charge them. Ah, that took one shot too many. Come on. Oh, I hit him. Okay, good. I still need that mosquito dead here. That's always the first thing I kind of do. Because they got the range on me. And I feel like as a trickster. That's bad. That's bad. Okay. So 
So now I need him there. Because there are more enemies coming soon. Or maybe I should get rid of the alpha performers. Dangerous as so. hell. Oh, perfect. Perfect little teleport out of your Where's my ammo box? Okay, let's just ammo or chaos it up. That gun is so loud. Perfect teleport again. And I got my ammo back. It will break my heart when I have to dismantle it, but it's gonna be for a good cause. Perfect teleport. Oh, oh no. Oh boy. Stop it. I need to death in a second. Okay. I saw you. Well, uh, this game is kind of peaceful to play. As much as killing floor is kind of peaceful for me to play. Okay, I can snap again, right? Four shots. And I still haven't found the ammo. Oh boy. Oh, that was a big explosion. There's the ammo. Mosquitoes, alphas, no, not that much better. Come on, dodge. Oh, bastard. I'm just gonna take my time and make sure I hit some good. Thunder strikes on them. Come on. This map actually killed me quite a lot. Oh, did you see that juicy explosion? You're almost dead. Yeah, level wise, this is my strongest weapon. I uh, still feel like Emerald Chaos is badass to play with. Bastard. Oh, that's a mental error. Do not shoot that shot. Those shots at the stings. Oh boy. Ah, and I missed my last one. Cool. 
Bastard, no, no. I need you dead. Just like I need you dead. I feel like the big differences between Stray and this game is that this game I can master even half a slave at this point. Because the update made it quite There's a storm coming your way. There's a well easier. Here. Spewing anomaly energy, it's creating the storm. That's what's causing the vibration. At least I know I haven't completely lost my mind. Now get out of there. Ah. Okay. Detected. Access granted. I feel like my English fluency has loosened up a little bit while playing this. It's tragic that this loot can't be APOC. 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 Like, that could have been a good helmet to have. Blue. I got oh, how? Why did I get so much blue stuff here? Oh, what's that? Rifle blight bearer. That actually looks cool. You know what? I feel like I actually kind of test that. Wait. It's a rifle, right? Not a shotgun. This looks kind of cool though. I wish you could upgrade that into an APOC, APOC gear gun. The Blight Bearer. Where's the other rifle? Uh, resource Rage. Let's compare. I mean, of course, it's better. It's APOC. Rifle standard variant. This kind of looks cool. Maybe I'll do a little raid with it. Oh, even though it's worthless. Yeah, yeah. So thanks for watching. I'm gonna finish this video here and peace out. Yo.